bed bugs are tiny little creatures that have instilled fear into many a pilgrim. But are they a danger and what can I do about it? The short answer is, they are more of a nuisance than a danger. Some people can have horrible reactions to their bites and they do like to travel. They are not, though, a souvenir that you will want to take home with you from your Camino. You may have seen news reports about relentless outbreaks of bed bugs in France in recent years. Bed bugs love to travel and they are no respecter of borders. Whilst they may have hit the news in 2023, they have regularly been popping up on the Camino for a long time. A backpack or even a shoe is an ideal place for a bed bug to hitch a ride before taking up residence in a different location. Before you know it, a new infestation can break out. Hospitaleros and hosts of other accommodation along the Camino are aware of this and there are several things they do to mitigate against it. For example, you may notice that many of the hostels have plastic blue mattresses. They may also provide paper disposable sheets or sheets that are washed obviously every day. This is to prevent bed bugs. Most accommodations are rigorous in their cleaning and they will deal with any new outbreak promptly. Some albergues request that you store your backpack in a central area and only take to your room the items that you need overnight in a plastic box. Most albergues also request that you store your hiking shoes in a communal area. Before you settle into your accommodation, check around the bed for telltale black marks. These are their excrement. Gross, I know. Lift up the corner of the mattress and look underneath, particularly at the head end of the bed. Bed bugs also like hard surfaces and can hide in skirting boards or behind pictures. If you see any red flags before settling into your bunk or your bed, speak to the hospitalero and move out before the bed bugs move into your stuff. However, they are notoriously hard to spot. If you find that you have clusters of bites, particularly on the top half of your body, you may have had a bed bug encounter. They also take a couple of days for the bites to show up. Some people also don't react to their bites, so they may not know that they have actually encountered bed bugs. I woke up one morning after dreaming of bed bugs. I checked my bed and did find a dead bed bug. It wasn't squashed, and in hindsight, what I think had happened was that the accommodation had probably had an outbreak. This happened to me in a hostel or a guest house in a room that I was sharing with another pilgrim. She experienced no issues at all, and as I discovered this only after she had left for the day, I spoke to the owner on my own. At first he told me that it was impossible that I had found a bed bug in the room, but he did come up to the room with me and on the way he'd gone into a cleaning cupboard and picked up a can of spray. He suggested that I brought the bed bug with me. I did go along with this theory, although I didn't really believe it, and I asked him to please spray my backpack and also spray my shoes, which he duly did. On reflection, I think it's possible that the hostel had found some bed bugs and had treated the room. And this is why I found an unsquashed dead one, but I'll never really know. The next thing was to deal with my stuff and to prevent any possible spread. Most of my gear was inside a pack liner. I carried on with my day and when I arrived at my next albergue, I used their washing machine and dryer and I washed and dried everything. I didn't have any bed bug bites and I didn't experience them again. Another thing that I did to prevent possibly picking up bed bugs on the Camino before I left was to spray my pack with permethrin. I also sprayed my sleeping bag and my shoes. And I don't know if it does any good, but it did make me feel better knowing that I'd taken precautions. Have you had any bed bug encounters on the Camino? And what did you do? Or are you preparing for your first Camino? Are bed bugs a major concern for you? Please do share them in the comments below and hopefully others will be able to share some